We now will demonstrate to you what an actual user experience is like, both as the participant and as a moderator. So here's an example project that we have up here with a few participants. Um, I'll go ahead and just launch this test participant here. There's a couple ways that you can launch a participant. Um, whether you're in a facility, you can just go ahead and click launch or you can send them the remote participant URL. So we're both in facility and remote capable. I'll go ahead and launch this participant here. It'll take them through a few questions. If we have a survey included, we have a nice opt-in question that we ask to view their video. We will just line up their webcam, ask them for permission to turn it on, and then they can click OK, I'm ready, whenever they're ready. Shit, my pants. Right here? Ship my pants, you're kidding. You can ship your pants right here. You hear that? I can ship my pants for free. Wow, I just may ship my pants. Yeah, ship your pants. Billy, you can ship your pants too. I can't wait to ship my pants, Dad. I just shipped my pants and it's very convenient. Very convenient. I just shipped my drawers. I just shipped my nighty. I just shipped my bed. If you can't find what you're looking for in store, we'll find it at Kmart.com right now and ship it to you for free. And that is the very simple, easy user experience. As the moderator, they'll have access to the console. So if we go here and look at those results, we should see test participant, should see some results soon. So results are available in just about real time. It's about the length of the ad is how long it takes to see results here. So we see some results here now for test participant and you can use these results to basically probe participants further um, past your initial discussion guide. Um, so green indicates a positive response, red will indicate a negative response. Um, you can expand the trace here and even see a little bit more detail on the type of response that's being shown. And then we also have a post session. So after field work is complete, we'll deliver a dashboard to you. Um, and that basically includes a little bit more data, um, very similar to the console and its setup, um, but instead of having, or in addition to having the individual traces, you'll also have the results grouped up in aggregate. Um, so you'll have a nice little aggregated trace here so you can make some additional insights from the ad um, from the group as a total. We'll also upload some faces. So you can actually see what that data looks like firsthand. Um, and then we also have all the metrics that we code for in the dashboard as well. So a lot of really useful tools to be used in AFDEX Discovery.